hi students today let's solve some word problems now let's solve this word problem question is monica had in her account 2183 rupees monica had in her bank account 2183 rupees and then she again deposited some more money how much 1345 rupees she already had 2183 rupees in her account and then she deposited again 1345 rupees now what we have to find out is how much money is there now her total bank balance how much it is there that we have to find out okay let's find out we have to write the solution monica had in her account is equal to 2183 rupees when we write we put the symbol first a rupee symbol first and then we write the amount but when we say we say 2183 rupees okay and this is rupee symbol now monica had in her account 2183 rupees she deposited is equal to 1345 rupees total bank balance that is what we have to find out so we have to write total bank balance is equal to now how, how to find out this we have to add the amount which she had already in her account plus what she deposited after that then we will get the total bank balance so let's add the rupee symbol we will write first 2183 rupees plus 1345 rupees okay after that we will do the addition we have to make the place value chart thousand hundred tens then ones now we will write the amount which is simple i put outside 2183 plus 1000 345 under the 3 plus 5 is equal to 8 8 plus 4 is equal to 12 to be right here and one we carry here. okay 1 plus 1 2 2 plus 3 5 2 plus 1 3 how much we got 3528 now after doing this addition we will come back here and we will write hence the hence comma the total bank balance bank balance is equal to Okay, symbol first, then three thousand five hundred twenty-eight. This is how we find the total amount of or total bank balance. Once again, the question is: Monica had in her account two thousand one hundred eighty-three rupees. Again, she deposited. One thousand three hundred forty-five rupees. Find the total bank balance, or find the total amount in her bank account. So we have to write the solution. 
Monica had in her account is equal to two thousand one hundred eighty-three rupees. She deposited is equal to one thousand three hundred forty-five rupees. Total bank balance is equal to two thousand one hundred eighty-three rupees plus one thousand three hundred forty-five rupees. After that, we have to do the addition. These two amount we have to add and get the total amount. Then we will get the total bank balance in the account. So we wrote here first place value chart and then the amount which is to be added. That is two thousand one hundred eighty three rupees plus one thousand three hundred forty five rupees. After addition, we get the total amount three thousand five hundred twenty eight rupees. After that, come back and write. Hence, the total bank balance is equal to three thousand five hundred twenty-eight rupees. Our next question is: At a meeting, a political leader was addressing to people. In that meeting, there are two thousand six hundred forty-nine men, three thousand two hundred fifty-nine women, eight hundred thirty-seven. children find the total number of people attended the meeting that is the question for that we have to write the solution number of men attended meeting is equal to 2649 number of women attended meeting is equal to 3259 number of children attended meeting is equal to 837 Now the question is asked to find the total number of people attended the meeting. So whenever it is asked to find the total number of, it is understood that we have to do the addition. Okay, find the total number of. Whenever it is asked to find the total number of, we have to do the addition and then we get the total number. So right, total number of people attended meeting is equal to. Two thousand six hundred forty-nine plus three thousand two hundred fifty-nine plus eight hundred thirty-seven. After that, we have to do the addition. Thousand hundred tens and ones. Then we have to write this numbers: two thousand six hundred forty-nine plus three thousand two hundred fifty-nine plus eight hundred thirty-seven. Then we have to do the addition. Nine plus nine is equal to eighteen. Eighteen plus seven is equal to twenty-five. So five we do here. Then two we carry here. Two plus four is equal to six. Six plus five, eleven. Eleven plus three, fourteen. Four. Then one carry. One plus six. Seven plus two nine nine plus eight seventeen one yeah one plus two three three plus three six there is nothing to add so six we will write here so what is the total we got is six thousand seven hundred forty five how many people were there total six thousand seven hundred forty five so we will write. Hence, total. Hence, comma total number of total number of people attended meeting is equal to six thousand seven hundred. Forty-five, six thousand seven hundred forty-five. This many people were there. 
in the meeting at the meeting political leader was addressing to people there were 2649 men 3259 women 837 children its question is asked to find the total number of people attended the meeting for that we have to write the solution number of men attended meeting is equal to 2649 number of women attended meeting is equal to 3259 number of children attended meeting is equal to 837 total number of people attended meeting is equal to all these three numbers we have to add 2649 plus 3259 plus 837 after that we have to do the addition so when we add we get 6745 so we'll write here hence total number of people attended meeting is equal to 6745 our next question is in a cycle factory they produce cycles in 2010 they produced 2851 cycles in the year 2010 they produced 2851 cycles in the year 2011 they produced 3670 cycles then in 2012 they produced 2895 cycles the question is asked to find the total number of cycles they produced in this three consecutive years so let's write the solution number of cycles produced in 2010 is equal to 2851 Number of cycles produced in 2011 is equal to 3,670. Number of cycles produced in 2012 is equal to 2,895. Total number of cycles produced in these three consecutive years is equal to 2,851 plus 3,670. Plus 2,895. All these three will add and get the total number. Thousand hundred tens. 2,851 plus 3,670 plus 2,895. We do the addition. One plus five is equal to six. One plus five is equal to six. Five plus seven, twelve. Twelve plus nine, twenty-one. Two, we have. Two plus eight, ten. Ten plus six, sixteen. Sixteen plus eight, twenty-four. Two, we have. Two plus two, four. Four plus three, seven. Seven plus two, nine. So total number of cycles we got is nine thousand four hundred. 16 hence the total number of cycles produced in 3 years Is equal to is equal to nine thousand four hundred sixty. This many cycles in three years they produced. Number of cycles produced in two thousand ten is equal to two thousand eight hundred fifty one. 
number of cycles produced in 2011 is equal to 3,670. Number of cycles produced in 2012 is equal to 2,895. Total number of cycles produced in three consecutive years is equal to 2,851 plus 3,670 plus 2,895. Then we have to do the addition. Make the place value chart and then write down the numbers. Then do the addition. 2,851 plus 3,670 plus 2,895 is equal to 9,416. So, hence the total number of cycles produced in 3 years is equal to 9,416. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe. Press the bell icon to stay tuned.